깨봉 Math is a lie. Learning math, we have to see with our eyes, listen with our ears, and feel with our bodies. Then, we will never forget it. Once you learn, it's hard to forget no matter how many years go by. It should be the same for math. That is what we call real learning. Here, we have a problem. What is 6 divided by 0? Most people can't answer this question correctly. Why? It's because they are taught to blindly memorize formulas without understanding their meanings. <sighs> Most people don't bother to ask why. As a result, creative people tend to dislike math. No, no! Math is highly abstract. And that's why math is so hard to understand because its concepts are not tangible. Abstract is the absence of details. I know this seems like it's going nowhere, but bear with me. Ignoring the details and jotting down an equation makes it difficult for us to comprehend. Now, this all links back to the reason of why we have to learn by visualizing, listening, and feeling. In math, we enhance our senses by giving shape and form to abstract things in order to create a more visual image. 6 divided by 0 is the same thing as dividing 6 by 0. Well, duh! To divide is to distribute. Its definition is extremely simple. But when do you need to stop distributing? until there's nothing left to distribute. First, let's try 6 divided by 3. There are 6 apples. We distribute 3 apples to each person. So, the answer is 2. Then, what is 6 divided by 2? How about 6 divided by 1? It's obviously 6, right? Now let's divide 6 by 0. Look, a monkey! I think it came to distribute some apples. How nice! It attempts to give one apple, but brings it back, because it's told to share zero apples. The monkey just shared zero apples to one person. The monkey repeats this process to another person. Again and again, the monkey goes sharing zero apples to each person. As mentioned earlier, division goes on until there is nothing left to share. We still have six apples left. Off goes the monkey to keep distributing those apples. No matter how fast the monkey is, nor how many ears pass by. It can't share the apples. So what happens to the monkey? It dies. Oof, sorry. I expected this to be a and they lived happily ever after story. So this is called an error. If you see a problem like 6 divided by 0, you will now picture this poor little monkey who died after trying to share some apples. Now, let's phrase this question with words. This tells us to distribute. Distribute six things. Zero things to each person. Share zero means to share nothing, which then means to not share at all. These two meanings contradict each other. We call this irony. Good vocabulary word. Look it up. We have to clearly remember the meaning of division and zero. Now do you understand why dividing by zero results in an error and is impossible? Let's try using a calculator to compute 6 divided by zero. 6 
6 divided by 0. Error. Funny when I was your age story. Computers used to break while calculating 6 divided by 0. Nowadays, operating systems kill these programs. 0 has a lot of power, right? Dividing by 0 has the power to destroy any number. Let's learn about the power of 0 next time. Summary time! 6 divided by 0. Distribute, but give nothing. After all this, you'll never forget what 6 divided by 0 is. Right? Sharing apples, monkeys dying. Yay, yay. Like this, we should be able to use our imagination and create images. Color it, make sounds, and animate it. The purpose of math Develop your creativity. Math is a lie. That's it. Gibble. Gibble.